Hello, welcome to Cooking with Candace. Today is football Sunday, and what better meal to have than your ultimate wings? Today's meal is going to be Parmesan garlic wings, also lemon pepper wings, and your spicy garlic. So let's get started. So here are the items that you would need for your wings. Most importantly, the seasonings. You start off with garlic salt, garlic powder, poultry seasoning, lemon pepper, parsley flakes, and chicken rub. You'd also need your chicken wings. Depending on how many people you're feeding will determine how large of a bag that you will need. This is actually a four pound bag. Also, you will need your minced garlic, your Frank's Red Hot Sauce, some type of buffalo sauce, Parmesan shredded cheese, your oils, which can be canola oil, vegetable oil, whichever kind of oil you decide to choose. and butter. Okay, so while we talked about making three different kinds of chicken wings, we still season all the chicken wings with the same seasoning and the sauces are different. So first we're going to add our poultry seasoning onto our chicken and you wanna make sure that you clean the chicken, rinse it off before you actually start with the seasoning. We're going to add our garlic salt. Our lemon pepper. Your garlic powder. Parsley flakes, and your chicken rub. Once you have all the seasonings on there, then you will close the container and shake it up to make sure that the season is evenly around your chicken. Shake your chicken up until it's evenly coated with all the seasonings just like this. What we're going to do now is pour about two cups of our oil into our preheated pan that's been on low. Once the oil is in the pan, then we're going to go ahead and turn it up on medium until we start to see it bubble. As you can see, the oil is starting to heat up and bubble. Now you're gonna add a half a cup of margarine or butter here until it's melted. And once it's melted, then we know that our that our oil is hot enough to go ahead and start to put our chicken in. So the butter has melted into the oil and it's frying. Now we're going to start to add pieces of our chicken into the hot oil. You want to make sure that you give it enough room, enough space for the chicken wings to cook. Don't try to crowd all the chicken wings into one skillet.
And you'll let these cook. And how you'll know they're cooking, they'll start to brown a little bit. And then you'll flip them over. Um, and let them do the same thing on the other side. So we'll come back and check on these in about 15 minutes. So our chicken wings are starting to brown. And they have been cooking for about 15 minutes. Now we're going to flip them over. As you can see, they're browning a little bit. And depending on how you like your chicken wings cooked, some people like them fried hard, some people don't like them as hard. I like mine a little hard because once you add in the sauces, it will soften your wings up. So we're going to let these cook evenly on the other side and we'll be back to check them in a second our chicken wings are ready what we're going to do now as you can see they are brown and pretty nice with that crispy kind of feel to them so now what we're going to do is put them into a bowl laced with paper towels to kind of soak up some of the grease because you don't want them to be so greasy once you add the sauces on them so we're going to start to take them out and put them into the container okay so now we're going to make our sauces up two of these sauces contains your margarine or your butter and so we have a normal spoon that we're going to go ahead and put into our first container and we have another one that we are going to put into our second container now one of the sauces is pretty easy we're just going to add a little bit of lemon pepper. That should be enough because the lemon pepper is pretty potent. And then we're going to add in our Parmesan cheese to the second one. And that should be about enough. And into that one we're also going to add in about a spoon, half a spoon of garlic your minced garlic we're also going to take another half a spoon and add it to our empty bowl we're going to pour just a little bit of our buffalo wing sauce into that container with a few sprinkles of our Frank's Red Hot After we do that, we're going to move it to the microwave until everything has completely melted and we're going to stir it up. That will be the completion of our sauces. Our sauces are all completed and we have some wings that are already cooked and done. Now what you're going to do is this is our lemon pepper. We're going to add a little bit to this container. This is our spicy garlic. We're going to add a little bit to this container. And this is our Parmesan garlic. We're going to add some to this container. You might need a spoon for this one to get some of the cheese in there. Once you've added those to their rightful containers, then you're going to close the container and shake it out. And you'll do this to each container so that the sauce is evenly spread it throughout your wings.
and there you will have your three different flavors of wings. Our chicken wings are done and ready to be served. We topped off our Parmesan garlic with a little sprinkle of the grated Parmesan cheese and it's plated and ready to be served. Thank you for tuning in with Cooking with Candace. I hope these wings made your Sunday a great day. You can also like or subscribe to my YouTube channel or check me out on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. And if you missed last week's Cooking with Candace Crock-Pot Chicken Noodle Soup, check me out.